Listen, it's always good to have a replay camera. That's the best part about it. It's Tonky down the floor. Those players up front, they're a little bit maybe more athletic, though, with how they go four and five. And there's Caitlin Clark. Falter had a wide open. Gabby Marshall took the underneath. Blocked. Clark there to clean it up. Three so far here in the opening. Nine plus minutes. Davis for three. She drills her second. Fourth double double of the season. Caitlin Clark finally drills a three. 11 and a half minutes of this ball game as they did in 40 on Tuesday. Martin, nice footwork. Oh. Or just leading the game. What a find! because of how well they move with each other. Target with numbers, finds a falter. Clark got into the paint, used the bottom. Stay nice and big down low and create those opportunities. Now look, you're down 25, coming out of the locker room, you know. Keeping her balance. Back to Clark, triggered the inbound. Off of Destiny Adams, who has only taken three triples all year. Clark got around. The foul on Herder. They'll count the bucket. It's allowed Caitlin Clark to get to the basket. I mean, one on one, the help side just shows, doesn't even try to stop the ball, and she just keeps going all the way to the end. Nobody picked up Kate Martin in transition. Jam packed here. Arenas are sold out all across the Big Ten. Clark for three. Hits again. Clark. Put on the gas all the way to the bucket. She just took it 89 feet. Great battle of the bigs between Mackenzie Holmes and Alexis Markowski. Uh, enough. So much the type of player that you hate to play against, one on your team. Lisa Bluter loves her, some Kate Martin. There's the pass, there's the assist. Right on cue of Caitlin Clark, triple double. It's going to be massive for the Hawkeyes for spreading the floor, having multiple people step up. And